Hentai too. Yo guys, what's going on? Here we are at day two of KatsuCon. Uh, currently, right now, we're at the uh, Demon Slayer uh, photo shoot meetup. As you can see, I'm um, Zenitsu, and right over here, and Jen, say Yo. hello. What up? Jen is Daki, obviously from Demon Slayer, and Dan, Boji. who are you? Boji from Ranking of Kings. The, the best king, or prince, I should say, right? Thank you. Everyone keeps saying king, but prince. But yeah, we're just here at this photo shoot, and so far it's incredible. And everybody's cheering for Jen because uh, she's like the only doc here right now. Um, but we finally had an Akaza come up, and all the Ren Gokus had to go back up, and it's hysterical. <laughs> they were like, oh, we're gonna have to get everyone back up here. Gotta relive the trauma. <laughs> God damn it, not again. <laughs> but yeah, I'm, I'm Zanitsu. Yeah. <laughs> Yep. Boom, let's get in there.
guys what's going on it is day three the final day yep unfortunately uh it's so <laughs> sad to say it but it, it's been such a blast so far and yep. i we're, we're actually <laughs> it's a funny story uh last night we got a little crazy and uh Jen lost her badge, yeah. uh, but thankfully when we were um, getting our badges, they told us to write our numbers on the back Very and important. someone uh, someone actually called or um, actually not called, they texted her and said, hey, we got your badge, come to here and uh, pick it up. And so that's what me and Dan are doing right now. Yep, so also if we die, uh, you'll know what happened. <laughs> Dan. Dan was uh, knocked out on the uh, the toilet last night. On the toilet? Yeah. What? You were You were like, Oh on, the, on the toilet. That's why I was like, bro, you need to, you oh need to get. <laughs> and the worst sure part. I remember that. The worst part was that we ordered McDonald's and like 20 minutes later, I go to get Dan and he's like, just dead. And I'm like, oh no, <laughs> what do I do? <laughs> and then like a, like a good pal, I waited for him and I woke him up and put him in his bed. And uh, Thank you. then Thank this you morning, what did you do this morning? You were like the McDonald's. <laughs> oh yeah, I knocked out. I knocked out before I got to even eat my McDonald's. So I heated it up. Yeah, I was like, he was like, the McDonald's, oh no. Did I, did I throw up or something? N no, there wasn't even anything in the toilet. You, you you just... I was drinking I, the toilet water. I, no, <laughs> I guess you felt like you were going to throw up and <laughs> it, you just sat there and then like your hands bo were just both on like the rim uh, and I was like, oh no. Uh, <laughs> but it's okay, so you, you, clean, you cleaned up water. this morning. Yeah, you just yeah. drink some toilet water, it's fine. <laughs> but yeah, so we're just getting Jen's badge right now and then we're uh, going to go back in dan's got to pick up a like a bottle opener it's yep. like the oblivion key from uh yeah. Hearts, correct yep. yeah so we're gonna be going and getting that and uh knowing me i'm probably gonna buy another figure because <laughs> you know no problem catch there, the deals. There, there's no no i got no nope. problem i swear nope not at all <laughs> what, what 80 you bought so far uh, uh no no it was uh 65 okay. yeah it was, it was only 65 uh Wait, are you talking like how many? How many? Oh, no. <laughs> I thought you were talking about the price. Uh, no, 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 no. <laughs> um, I only bought one thing so far and a piece of art. Um, Ooh, I'm going to have to show my uh, my Zorro figure that I got later. Really cool custom. Oh, yeah. The, I, I filmed the guy earlier in the vlog, but this guy, he, he does uh, takes... What did he say? He takes like... He finds uh, like blemished figures, so they, they usually end up being a little bit cheaper, but there's basically nothing wrong with them. He touches them up with some paint and then uh, puts them on cool platforms of their own, which, like you were saying, a lot of people have a problem with just plain bases and uh the ones he has are awesome yeah it's incredible like there was the rimuru and it was on like a dragon skull oh, and the yeah. dragon skull was glowing blue for like uh, kind of uh tempest something yeah. tempest the yeah, dragon's name is it. yeah and it I, I like I said I filmed it earlier and the guy does amazing work but he only does custom work and there's only one of a kind he, he told us to make sure he's like yep. well, if you ever take a picture of a video tell everybody that it's a one of a kind and that's it and uh, that's it but I think you can commission right yep. if you email him or contact yeah, him you can commission, commission and um, yeah I will we'll show the figure later in more detail but um, yeah we're just gonna get Jen's badge and then uh, I'm gonna film some more cosplays inside and probably film a little bit of uh, like a conclusion yep. or whatever when we're on the way home so see you then Later. badge retrieval was a success <laughs> all right <laughs> So we just walked out of uh, Jinya Ramen Bar here in DC, right by uh, Logan Circle. It's actually up that way, and uh, that was really good. Yo, Dan, how good was that? It was really good. It was yeah, really it was tasty. Spicy you got the spicy uh, ramen? Yeah, spicy tonkatsu. Got some gyoza. The gyoza was definitely really good. Yeah, the gyoza was like, I mean, just like Dan said, fantastic. Oh, yeah. um, 
I got the, uh, it was called the Yuza Shibo, Shino, I think, uh, ramen. Egg. And that was really good. It was like a clear broth. It had chicken, pork, uh, seaweed, egg. And then, what'd you get, Jen? Do you remember? I got like a regular, regular tonkatsu. tonkatsu. But, I mean, if you're, uh, if you live in the DC area, or if you stop by, definitely check out that place, because uh, that was, it was really good. Yeah. And also, the uh, I filmed the sake. The sake we oh, had. Oh, that was yeah. That yeah. was yeah. really, yeah. That, nice it was fresh. very, very, it was a little sweet, yeah. smooth. Subtle. Yeah, yeah, it was very good. So I put that in the video as well, but definitely check out that brand if you like sake. When Todoroki and Midoriya do they both their attacks at the same time, you can see. Just got home from our long trip. Um, just wanted to show the stuff I got at the convention. Uh, Jen got me this little Goku plush. Amazing, adorable, 11 out of 10. Um, I got Jimmy this Pokemon Red from Japan. Very cool. Um, got this Oblivion Keyblade bottle opener. It'll be very useful. Um, got this little Espeon in a kind of terrarium looking thing. And then I got uh, an Espeon GX card to go with it. Got this awesome little Ampharos. Um, got this one piece ship figure that I'm gonna have to put together. Uh, I'll show it at some point when I get it together. And this, the piece de resistance. Here it is. It's awesome Zoro. We put this in the video earlier, but it was a guy who does um, just customs. Um, so they're one of one. He takes blemished figures, uh, paints them up, adds this uh, this cool base, and you know does whatever else he feels for the character. This one came out to 120, which for me is completely worth it. It's unique, um, and I love it. What's going on? It's Brian here. Uh, sorry if the video or audio sounds a little different. It's because I'm recording from my phone right now. Uh, yesterday was the last day of KatsuCon. Today's Monday. Uh, we had to drive home and we didn't get home until like 9 o'clock. So we were just saving the outro for today. Um, but I just wanted to give my final thoughts and opinions on the uh, con. And also I got my haul behind me here, which I'm going to show you right now. So just let me flip the camera. All right, and first off, we're starting with the uh, Super Master Stars piece Bakugo figure. I got the brush version, and as you can tell, I'm holding him right now. He uh, he's a big boy, uh, and I really like the facial expression that they gave him on this piece. The details look really nice. I like the glowing hands. It's a nice little touch there. Um, so this piece is really nice. I got him for like sixty-five dollars or something from the vendor. Um, so I think that's normally what they go for. It might be a little cheaper, um, but I felt like that was a pretty good price for his size, and he, he was pretty weighty too. Then I also got Gojo from Jujutsu Kaisen, and this is just like a band presto figure, so this isn't anything super crazy or special, but you know, I figured I'd pick him up. I don't have any uh, Jujutsu Kaisen uh, figures yet. And then the last guy is the man himself, Aaron Yeager. This piece is actually pretty nice. This is also like a Master Stars piece, apparently. Uh, but I guess it's not a super Master Stars piece. Um, but yeah, he's looking real nice here. I like the details on his coat. He's got like a, you know, just a regular, not simple base like Gojo here. But, you know, it's a little bit more detail and stuff. Um, you can see the stuff, uh, the detail on his boots. And he's got the Scouts uh, logo on his cape here. Uh, he's looking real nice, so I'm going to just zoom out here real quick, show everything. So yeah, that's everything I got. Um, let me flip the camera around again. So I just wanted to say my final thoughts on the con. Uh, it was a lot of fun. It was amazing seeing everybody's costumes and cosplay. Um, a lot of people went all out on it. Um, but yeah, I'm sure Dan's going to show his haul and Jen's haul. Uh, Jimmy didn't come, so he's got nothing, but, um, hopefully he'll come next time. Uh, other than that, I mean, you know, it was great. The artist alley was awesome. The, uh, merchant alley was awesome. Um, there was like a rave, but sadly we didn't get to go into the rave because you needed like to check your bag and the line for that was ridiculously long at the time. So we were like, forget it. We'll just, you know, go somewhere else and party. There, there was parties all over the place. Uh, I'm sure we'll talk more in depth on our podcast, but, um, 
uh, Compact Crew podcast on Spotify and Apple Music or Apple Podcast and anywhere you can basically watch or listen to a podcast. Uh, but yeah, the, it was a fantastic time and I can't wait to go back next year, hopefully if I can go. And um, if Dan or Jen have anything else to say, I'm sure they'll put it in after this. But uh, other than that, I appreciate you guys watching. And uh, if you like the video, um, please give it a thumbs up and comment on it and share it with all your friends. Uh, so this is going to be a disclaimer uh, for the cosplayers that were in the video. If we didn't tag uh, your account, it's either one, because I forgot, <laughs> like an idiot, or two, it's because you just didn't have one. So if you happen to see a cosplayer in the video that uh, we didn't get the tag, please comment in the uh, comments below who they are or, what, or their Instagram, whatever social media they have. Uh, but I tried my best this time to uh, really get as many Instagrams or social medias as I could. So I, uh, yeah, hopefully I did a good job. But like I said, thanks again, guys, for watching. I hope you have a good day. Peace.